Charles, Philip Phillips, Luke Bryan. Just some of the many famous musicians to make it out of South Georgia and onto the big stage. Chelsea Battle dreams of one day joining the greats, and Darton music professor Steve Scott thinks she can. Certainly she has a capability, absolutely. And there have been very many uh, times in our two and a half years now working together that she has shown that. Um, thrilling moments. But getting to the top takes more than talent. It takes a lot of hard work and long hours, practicing and studying all the various forms of music technique. You have to do all those things. You have to know music theory, you have to know music history, you have to know form, you have to know style, you have to know um, poetry. Performing since the age of seven, Chelsea Battle won her first big music competition last year. That competition was Dart and Star and she feels that was an amazing achievement. Um, it was just, it was really nice because that was my first time winning anything uh, majorly, so it, it was really exciting. Since winning Dart and Star, Chelsea has auditioned for The Voice, X Factor, and American Idol. And each time she has advanced a little further into the competition. Recently, she went to a national audition for The Voice and made it to the second round. Last year I tried out and I didn't make it. That was actually before Dart and Star, so... Um, it was kind of like, hey, you don't make the voice this year, but then you win Dart and Star, then you advance an X Factor, then you win another competition, and then I go to the voice, and I made it through the first round of the voice this time. And um, when I went to the second round, there was only, gosh, like out of the 10 to 20,000 that you see on the audition dates in the first round, there were maybe like 15 to 20 people at the second round. So it was a huge deal. With a lot of hard work, dedication, talent, and focus, Chelsea Battle will go far in the music world. And who knows, maybe one day you just might see her name in lights. Carly Shiver reporting.